addressing now the in-laws of the cows that they are going to pay for ilobolo, not lobola, ilobolo. So they would name cows by their names. And they would say, I'm going to 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 say, and then they name these cows according to their ancestors. And then Uktemeleza goes as far as more like an intercession. You're standing in the gap for your loved ones and addressing the ancestors so that they can give you answers according to what God wants. And then what would happen now, especially during the preparation of the battle, a king, especially King Shaga, would go to Msamo. Msamo, it's a Zulu temple of the household. As he burned the incense in Pepo and then addressing our ancestors, telling them that his regiments are now going to maybe have a fight with the and I'm making an example of um, So, and then as soon as he finishes, he goes to the crawl where the regiments are waiting, Amabut. And then what he's going to say, he will give an order to the regiments and say, today there is a battle between Usoshangane and me. And then the response of the regiments would go like, well, no one love, buy it. And then this dialect, because these are more like a dental clicks on Zinini, over the years it got uh, mispronounced in churches today, but because of that, I would say it's a pollution of eternality and the pollution of what we hear over the years. So Ugutemeleza remains the cornerstone of Abenguni remains the cornerstone of African people because I remember growing up when someone is sick at home or when a woman is about to give birth but there's a problem, maybe she's feeling so much pain and the child is unable to come out. An older woman would go outside and hit all the rooms or all their hearts in the yard and address the ancestors, actually, and shout to the ancestors and say, Ye den funu wei bon, len gane lele le swin len e puming an, ye den na chati mi nangoba, ye mi nom dala sang pili le min, and then an answer would be received. That was the role of Uktemeleza. During the Battle of San Juan, a general commander who was Jingoyoga Mahol, they say that as the battle was more like 10 kilometers apart, like the, the, the horns of a buffalo, Imagine he is in the center and he's running from this point to that point. Now he's busy interceding at Hemeleza. And then he will tell maybe this side, which you are not attacking now, but this horn is attacking. Be on standby. And then as he is moving to the other side, still we are Hemeleza to the other side, calling upon the kings. This is why Unjangabantu Ogongubane, who was close to King Shaga, actually, they say he used to design the spears of King Shaga. They say he saw a dark cloud rolling like this until when it came down, it transformed into King Shaga himself. He went to the commander and said, King Shaga is among us. And then general commander, they say he said, that was the power of Um Temeles. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
as these people started to get exposed to European music, because we need to remember one thing that when people say, uh, people like Kubabu KJJ were already attending these missionary schools. When we say, da 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 studied. Our elders already, or our ancestors were already getting exposed and now ascribing more value, taking these things that they are taught Gulama missionary schools and they coming back. This why initial anthem sounds like a church hymn. Now we need to thank those who started this movement of traditional churches, African traditional churches, such as Isayoni. How many? How many?
Ashambe in 1910 when he started a church called the Nazareth Baptist Church where he managed to teach black people that you can still worship God carrying this stick and talk to your God and you just let's man go bang go stand December just jump up in Costa Cali's permanent zone because this is a little in Costa Cali's permanent zone because this is a little what Jesus is all about. We are supposed to write our own music with our own nuances without having to borrow from the colonizers because these nuances as opposed to these are two worlds so it means when we are attending to these churches, we are ascribing more value to Europeans. We need a day where we'll say we need to have a church of Africa, like a united church of Africa. 